global symbols, because communication matters everywhere. Global symbols are established to meet the need for graphic symbols for people with little or no speech or communication. Regardless of location or geography, we want to create symbols that are familiar to users, that reflect their language and culture, and which are available freely and openly, and can be used by developers and vendors to create new products for people in new and emerging markets. Global Symbols has got a number of key features. I'm going to take you briefly through each, but they are fundamentally a symbol repository, a way of creating communication boards, a way of editing symbols, and support for training. The symbols are available at globalsymbols.com. There's a number of different symbol sets developed by different organizations. Those symbols are in different languages and reflect the culture within which they've been developed. We have tools and support to help people vote and determine and choose which symbols are right for them within their setting. Our board builder is a free online service where you can create simple communication boards by which people can communicate using the symbols that have been set for their community. They can also be very specific. So for instance, there are a range of symbols that relate to the pandemic, so that people in care homes and healthcare settings can create usable boards for when people can't communicate using speech as a result of infection. We offer a way in which symbols can be edited and created. We recognize that sometimes you need to develop a symbol that is slightly different to those available from other people. So in this case, we've combined the symbols for cat and bad to create the symbol for bad cat. And we understand fully and have worked closely with UNICEF to develop training materials that are openly licensed, that can be translated and localized for communities to build capacity in AAC and communication. Moving forward, what we're looking for are partners who would like to work with us in designing symbols for their community, who would like to disseminate tools and training, who are interested in adding symbols to existing projects. And to do this, we're looking for support with project funding, for capacity building for communities, and creating symbols, boards, training, and support. If you're interested in working with us, do please email me. You can find us at globalsymbols.com, on Facebook, and on Twitter.